Hope at Sea, an Adventure Story by Daniel Mieres. Whenever my world feels small, I turn to the sea. The new clipper ship is almost done. That means Papa will be leaving soon. He is the ship's carpenter and will keep it seaworthy on the long voyage. Oh, how I wish I could join him! I don't want to hear Papa's stories after he returns. I want to be part of those stories. I will stow away. Now's my chance. All aboard! Way anchor! Make sail! There's no turning back now. I can hear the sail snap to attention and salute the wind as we pick up speed. My stomach is in knots. Will I be discovered? Will Papa be angry with me? The deck is a flurry of activity. Everyone has a job to do, and every job needs doing. A sailor's life is harder than I thought, but I may be starting to get the hang of it. Papa has shown me that even the smallest twinkle of light can guide us. Our course has been set. We travel for weeks. The farther we go, the more cargo we load on board. Sugar from the West Indies. And now, coffee beans and cotton from Port Rio Grande. The ship feels more and more like home. I know the grain of each board like the freckles on my arm and every piece of rigging like the braid of my hair. I can tell the weather just by the tilt of the cabin or the creak of the hull. My journal is full of new stories to share, but I miss Mama. We're not far from port now. I can almost smell the bread baking in her oven. A storm is bearing down on us. Batten down the hatches! All hands on deck! Stay down below, Hope. Papa cries, but how can I when even hands as small as mine are needed? Rocks off the starboard side! Abandon ship! Our boats are no match for this rough and angry sea. Before us is only darkness. Then a small light appears on the horizon. Then another. And another until there is a wall of light guiding us home. On the rocky cliffs stand wives and children, and there is Mama. I thought my daily duties at sea were tough, but Mama runs a tight ship. Every morning, Papa goes down to the shore to collect wood from the wreckage. He has told me that our ship's story is not over yet. What could he mean? It's wood is being used to build our new home by the ocean. Papa might be done sailing the seven seas, but he still has an important job to do, and so do I. To keep the light shining. <laughs>